we at Paytm look at any particular category of business and line item, we start by saying, how can we increase the TAM for this? How can we increase more number of users for this? And TAM for us starts from users, the number of things, and then the revenue, and then the profit. So the TAM increase is not by just take the profit or incremental profit to yourself. We always look at that, how can we increase the user base? Our mission statement commits to increasing access of formal financial services, as we call it, that we will bring 50 crores Indians to the mainstream of the economy. The core bill behind it is to give access to different, different financial services, as you know, have taken a championing cause on payments. And we now believe that just like Paytm pioneered and gave your code to India and to our country as a way to do the acquiring, which is very ubiquitous and then extended the same thing in sound box. It is our opportunity to bring the dividend of payment in credit. The core philosophy for those two reasons, if you notice, will be small credit. The credit business works on percentage margin. So after a particular size and a percentage profit margin, there is enough cash in rupee value available on the table for you to introduce fixed and variable costs. Most of financial services organizations, obviously, including us, will have some fixed costs. And fixed cost becomes the detriment of giving small credit. So if you show a credit, let's say, of 1,000 rupees, even if you could be making 10%, it is just 100 rupees. The very fact that you're making 100 rupees on a big loan, even if it's a large percentage, makes it nearly impossible for someone to issue and collect that kind of credit size. Our commitment to India, our commitment to our country has been that we will solve for small payments ubiquitously, and extending that is we will solve for small credit ubiquitously. With that kind of approach, it is very imperative for us to split the work and extend, uh, bring a partner in the play. Our business model is based that the book, the underwriting is a part that a typical lender does and the disbursement where the acquiring customer helping that digitally get onboarded on the system, get the money in the bank account of the customer. And then in due course collection, is the scope that we learned are the biggest cost of the system. Or these are the biggest inefficiency, if you will, or under-executed scope, or now that India is going through mobile internet revolution, could be the place where we could ignore it. So PTM has done innovation on distribution and collection of small credit. And I believe that that is why we champion the same when it comes to loan size, ticket size of what PTM disperses. So we are rather happy being dispersing one crore loan of one rupee instead of one loan of one crore rupee. Obviously, this is a metaphoric number. Obviously, we are not dispersing one rupee loan either. Intent here is to say that how many more Indians we are able to serve with formal credit access that our country's regulator and government are aiming. So the innovation or the work that we focus on is how low cost we can acquire a customer and how low cost we can help collect the loan for a lender. That way is the lender's rating, performance, capabilities, their compounding knowledge of underwriting also becomes an add-on force to complete the good to them. We have issued millions of loans and we do that nearly now every month in different, different categories of consumer or a merchant, both which are primarily payment led relationships where there is a knowledge of or relationship of payment that gives us that there is a little bit more that we know about the customer, consumer or merchant. So we champion 1000 rupee loan, 500 rupee loan, 200 rupee loan, which typically are otherwise going to loan sharks or which is where if the technology can solve, it can easily solve 1000 crore rupee loan. A 1000 crore loan has a lot of maneuverability of costs there because there is a large enough margin as a rupee value again. So our business model is how at an extreme low cost to the customer, at an extreme low cost to the lender, you can bring both of them together.